The La Compagnia della Stella Company or Fellowship of the Star was the name of two separate companies of mercenary soldiers which operated in northern Italy at different times in the 14th century. Topic: <laughs> Compagnia della Stella of Albert Sturz The first company with the name was formed in August 1364 by the condottieri, soldiers of fortune, Anacino di Bongardo, Hanakin Baumgarten, Albert Sturz and Hugo della Zucca and was composed largely of English and German mercenary soldiers. Bongardo contributed the men of his own company and Albert Sturz many men of the White Company who followed him when he left it after its mauling at the Battle of Cascina. The name referred to the emblem of the Knights of Bingard, the family to which Anacino belonged. The following month Anacino left the company and command devolved to Albert Sturz. Under Sturz's leadership the company was hired by the Papal States who were engaged in hostilities with Perugia. The Star Company comprised about 5,000 cavalry and 1,000 infantrymen, while that of Perugia consisted of some 10,000. Fighting took place over five months in Umbria, Tuscany and Lazio, with the main battle taking place in San Mariano, near Corciano, where the Sturz forces were comprehensively defeated by the White Company in 1365. They were then hired by Perugia, but disbanded after Sturz had been accused of treachery by the Perugians and beheaded in the town. Topic: <laughs> Compagnia della Stella of Astore Manfredi. The second company of the name was formed in Sorogna in June 1379 by Astore I. Manfredi, who recruited adventurers mainly from Emilia Romagna, initially having a complement of about 600 lancers and 2,000 infantry. The company tried to attack Bologna and Rimini, but was then was hired by Bernabo Visconti of Milan and the Venetians during the War of Chioga between Venice and Genoa. In August 1379, on the orders of Visconti, they attacked Genoa and looted several villages of the city, including Sampierdarina. However, their most important battle took place on September 24 of that year when 400 lancers and 3,000 infantry under Manfredi were defeated by the Genoese near the Bassano Valley. Most of Manfredi's mercenaries were captured, with the exception of Manfredi himself, who was saved by a farmer to whom he promised a reward of 10,000 ducats. Many of the captured mercenaries were subsequently executed by the local people. 